morning in the line, Professor Cohen. This is the Forex Supermodel Racing Review for Friday. What is it? The uh, 23rd of um, September 2022. Always struggle with the day. Uh, anyway, um, we've got nothing to review for yesterday, so we can get straight into today's racing then. So for Friday the 23rd, we've got no filter one, which is our structural filter. We do have this ratio filter again, uh, uh, and we have no alternatives. So, uh, we're at Newcastle on the weather in the 515. It's a Phillies handicap class 5.3 or plus 0 to 70, 1 mile 498 yards. Modelled at 89. Now that's on the, on the slow side, so uh, it's a stamina event really. Uh, and uh, the horse we're interested in is this number 4 Ciola. Uh, uh, it's about 5 to 1, 9 to 2. We've managed to get uh, £2 per £8 unit, so that's £200 for us on at uh, 5 to 1. So we've uh, we got exposure of two pound per eight pound, which is a quarter, 0.25 of a unit. So uh, that's where we are with that then. So um, what do we know about this Ciola? It's had three runs. Uh, the first run was on the 29th of the 7th uh, at Southwell All Weather. Uh, so in the novice one mile three, uh, modelled at 89, which is the same uh, surface pace profile. Right, so, um, so it went in that race to start with, which is 11 furlongs. Uh, came fifth of ten, um, uh, and it was off the pace. Uh, it went on the rail, and it ran on. Uh, as a reasonable performance, uh, and that's the starting point for the horse. Then it then it went to Goodwood uh, in the uh, on the twenty sixth of the eighth in August. Uh, ten furlongs, maiden uh, fillies, maiden, good to soft. Now uh, the ten furlong at Goodwood is pretty much uphill for the first three or four furlongs. Uh, and so that's uh, that's a quite a stamina issue, uh, and the horse was uh, what was it doing? Uh, uh, it was uh, it was rear, uh, and then it was on the rail, and it ran on nicely, and and that was uh, uh, an 85, uh, 75 roughly, and this initial race was a uh, was a uh, an eighty one seventy nine. Now, uh, as far as we're concerned, anyway, uh, and the final run it's had is uh, on the sixth of uh, September. Uh, at Goodwood again, it's in a novice uh, stakes, 10 furlongs on soft, so uh, the ground has deteriorated uh, and again it's, uh, it's uphill for 3 or 4 furlongs, so it's quite stamina uh, inducing uh, and um, <coughs> the, uh, it was keen, so uh, it's, it's, uh, it was sort of throwing its head around, refused to settle for a while uh, and it was up with the pace uh, and then it, then it uh, faded slightly and it was eased basically. So bear in mind that was the third run which uh, gives it its handicap mark. And now it's got a handicap mark of official rating of se uh, 69. Uh, uh, and the thing about um, uh, the handicapper is that they have to go off, uh, off the what it's actually performed, not what it's potentially going to be able to perform so so the markers that they had were uh, predominantly in this first race uh, in a novice uh, 11 furlongs at Subtle where it was uh, it was within about three and a half length uh, and uh, we put this horse we think that's uh, uh, an underestimate considerable underestimate of his official rating basically uh, and it's because it's been slightly gamed uh, the classic scenario then is is you put it uh, in a in a mid reasonable race, uh, which gives it good mark the handicap of good markers, which was this one on the 29th of the, of the seventh, and then you put it in something which is uh, which is going to be slightly uh, shorter in distance uh, or longer in distance uh, to mess the handicap up really, uh, and uh, because um, uh, you've got this horse here uh, who's been in a couple of decent Goodwood races at good to soft and soft which will be ideal for this cell uh, one mile four uh, and uh, the, the handicapper is is really forced to to go off what it's actually done what, not what it could not what it could do uh, and therefore it's, it's coming pretty uh, generously in our opinion at 69 uh, and we put that horse at about uh, about an 80 an 80 plus really uh, so so it's got 10, 10 to 12, 15 pounds, depends how you look at it in hand on the handicap official ratings. Uh, and, uh, and if you look at the, uh, the shape of the other runners, uh, they're, they're not really progressive horses. They're, uh, they're uh, sort of static or on decline. Uh, so, uh, so that's what we're doing. 
the account as we said is static at 63.5 units hopefully this one gets going again uh, we're on uh, number four Ciola to win at five to one it's in the Newcastle or Nil weather at 515 it's about one mile four uh, just in a bit and uh, 98 yards so uh, and this horse has got all the uh, the criteria that we like for a ratio uh, filter it's uh, it's been slightly gamed uh, in our view, which means, in other words, it's uh, they've been looking after it for a lower handicap mark, and hopefully this is the day that it will uh, will come forward. So uh, it's wearing a hood as well for the first time, which may help it settle. So uh, so anyway, we'll keep our fingers crossed, and uh, we'll review it tomorrow. So thanks for subscribing, thanks for watching, and goodbye.